Hello, my viewer. Are you there and interested to learn the Kikuyu language? For you to be able to learn any language that you're not conversant with, it always starts by learning the vowels and the con consonants so that from the consonants and the vowels you are able to know how you combine them in a way that you can form words. For us then to be able to the Kikuyu language, we start by learning the Kikuyu vowels. The Kikuyu vowels are seven in number. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. How do we say them? This is a, 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 o, u, o. Again, a, a, e, a. O, U, and O. My dear viewer, please practice saying these vowels in Kikuyu. How do we say again? A, A, E, A, O, U, and O. Those are the Kikuyu vowels. And they are in number. Then we have the consonant. This comes from the consonants that we know in English. And these are the ones that exist in English. And this is how they are written. And in this case, in the upper case. How do we pronounce them? A, B, C, G, H, M, M, R, T, Y. This is T, W, N, Y. Again, A, B, C, G, H, K, M, A, R, T, T, W. This is how are written upper cases. However, we have the consonants, but in lower cases. They are written A. This is A for this A. We have B for this B. We have C for this C. We have G for G. We have H for H. Then we have K for this K. And then we have M. M. Then we have N, then we have R, we have T, we have W, and then we have Y. That forms the beginning for us to be able to learn the Kikuyu language. Thank you for viewing, and please don't forget to subscribe. This is your teacher, Teacher William.